Wow, it looks so good. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, it looks so good. Doesn't it look good? Well, it's time for this time to break forth the rhythm in my room. But first I want to show you my new addition. It's straight up tilt. So much better for me. And then I can just dig it into the ground. Easier to carry around. I have primed my area because my neighbor came by and he was like, you know what you need to do? You need to prime it. I want it to be Death Star TIE Fighter area. And I have a picture that I'm going to go off of and see how it fares. But first I want to show you a method that Eddie taught me. It's been so helpful for circles. We got string, we got scissors, and we have tape. So. I'm gonna take the middle part. Now, where's my end gonna be? Right about here. Let's see how it looks there. How it looks there. Maybe a little further. Let's do it right about here. And here, that's perfect. Let me give myself a little extra room because now I need to tie this to it. Now that I have that, I can make my circle. Okay, feeling good, feeling good. Feeling circular, feeling circular. Still feeling circular. <laughs> Things are twisting. Please meet. Please meet. Okay. Looks like this one went a little bit off. That's okay. We can fix it. There we go. There we go. That is for the most part circular. Darn. Now, take it off. Woo. Now we can move on. Oh, this is looking so cool. So now I'm gonna work on outlining that and then the background. Oh, yes. That looks so good. So good. Okay, so I did the base, 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 base. So I've decided that that's gonna be old Star Wars. This is gonna be new Star Wars. So I have like shadows of the Mandalorian and all the characters and shadows of like the rest of them. <laughs> and then I need to make this into a beautiful like background scape. Dude, this is gonna look amazing. This is the latest I've ever been out here painting. <laughs> Doesn't it look like it? I mean, I don't know if we can tell very easily through this because of the light. Doesn't looks it look so like it? Yeah, it looks really great. Well, let's we'll see if it translates in the daytime. It has been two days since my nighttime extravaganza. Let's go see what it looks like. I'll be in San Antonio. It looks good. Have a couple of things to touch up. It doesn't look half bad. That's a little too sharp for my taste, so I will try to do some of that splotching. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look good. That's cat prints. Is that funny? That's a cat print. I'm hoping to finish this bottom portion today, and then I'm going to finish up the Yodas to complete my awesome mural. I have to take a pause here. Oh my goodness. What do you think, sweetheart? Love it. Is it looking like the Death Star? Uh-huh. Uh, really, you think yeah, so? Yeah, it looks like the Death Star with like the broken Death Star in the sky. Yeah, the broken one. All right, I gotta take a physical therapy break and then I'll come back and start working on details. I'm thinking about finishing this today. Well, it's been two days later and it looks Pretty cool. I went and cleaned up her face a little bit with a little bit of water. Some of that stuff stays in there. Then I realized I got primer in places. I need to find those colors and just color match. Oh, one day I will be getting to you too. But right now we need to finish the Death Star and I want my TIE Fighter scene to happen. This is all I got for the night. What do y'all think? Love it. Will it look cool? Mm -hmm. Dude, I love these silhouettes. I'm gonna do a whole bunch of different silhouettes. Uh -huh. I think they're gonna look super cool. All right, let's see what the day brings me tomorrow. It is day who knows what, but I feel like today's the day that I'm gonna finish the Death Star. And in good fashion, I'm wearing my pew, 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 pew shirt. All right, let's go out into the sun. It is a gorgeous day today in Austin. Like 70 degrees, possibly 69. Nice day to paint. Oh, it's been several days and it looks so good. All right, now it's time for me to do the top part. Look, I started with those guys, but I'm also going to finish 
the rest of them and my idea for them. I can't believe I'm almost done with this mural in six months. That's crazy. Come take a look. Wow. It looks so good. <laughs> Whoa, it looks so good. Doesn't it look good? So I'm not quite done. I still need to darken the edges over here. How does my actual Death Star look? Like it looks great. You mean the, the actual like laser? The laser. Yeah, dude. Does it look okay? Does it come across? Yeah. Should I add across. a shadow or something? Yeah, maybe add well, hold on. What is the mock-up? Have. Well, I want to go away from the mock-up right now. Oh, okay. Then yeah, maybe add a little shadow to it. But it reads clear as day, babe. That's its laser. What if I do just a teeny weeny shadow? It'll uh, kind of pop out from it. Planet Destroyer. Oh my goodness. Okay, so now I'm going to do the, the outline and then the TIE Fighter scene, and then I'm going to add all of my little dudes. You know, the mock-up has it to where it's like, just like, you know, pieces of it destroyed over here. Mm -hmm. But I don't think I want to do that. I'm afraid to mess it up. I think I'm just going to leave it as is. Yeah. Don't you think it looks cool? Absolutely. All right, I'm going to finish this up. I cannot believe I'm going to finish this today. It looks so good, Mom. Good. Six months of doing this. I still have to do the Yodas, and that'll take me a couple of days, but like... A lot of those six months, however, were fixing mistakes, replacing chalk with <laughs> acrylic. Yeah, that's true. Fixing, like, I needed to primer. Look at how well she stayed after I primered her face. Has it rained? No. <laughs> I guess that'll do it. But it's the sun that takes me out. Yes, the sun. Oh. The I'm heat. stepping on this and it's all not dry. Uh, way to go, mama. Oh, what do you think about the outline? I put like a light gray as a shadow-ish. Is it fine like that? Yeah, it's fine. Or should I add a shadow to it? No, no, no shadow. No shadow, right? Okay, thanks guys. Well, this is my Death Star and I'm so proud. <laughs> Gonna work on the TIE Fighter scene. Do you see what I did with the outline? Yes. Does I that do. work? It works. Do you see what I did with the type? I'm gonna leave them silhouetted like that, and then, oh, do you hear the meow? Eee, Mr. Love Love! Hi, meow! <laughs> like, forget the tie fighter <laughs> and the X-Wings. Babe, does my X-Wing look like an X-Wing? Dude, are you kidding? It, it does, looks right? just like an X-Wing. So wait, yeah. do you think it's good just like that or should I do some details in black? I think that you should make them pure black. They'll disappear, Daddy. You think so? Because look, as black, they'll be silhouettes. Do you understand? Let me do the one that Mr. Fluff Fluff's on. <laughs> Mr. Fluff Fluff, what are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? All right, let me do that one and let's see what it looks like. Okay. But yeah, I see what you mean. At the top ones I worry about because I still am going to go black back there. But we don't necessarily need them all. And the great thing about acrylic is that you can just... Don't go all the way out. I'm not. Yeah. Like some little white accents or whatever. So why don't you pick the light source? The light's coming in from the top right. Oh, you know I don't roll like that. <laughs> like the what? What does that mean? <laughs> oh, man. Yep. I'm feeling this. All right, I think I like the black really well. So now I'm gonna work on the silhouettes. And I'm gonna do a little spackling for the stars. Been doing with the black? Yeah, absolutely. It looks like uh, you punched up the contrast a little bit. Eey, I'm getting good at this. I am so proud of this Death Star. Yeah, it, dude, it looks phenomenal. It's 8.30 in the morning and it is extremely cold. Like, <laughs> it's so cold. But I can't stop thinking about it. Today's my last day for the silhouettes. Let's go get her done. Oh, my goodness. I'm just tickled by this. This one's my new favorite. It's so detailed. Oh, and I was looking at pictures of this last night. It looks really good. I might add a little bit more to the shadows, but I went and darkened it up. It looks so good. Okay, time to do the shadows. Old meets new. So cool. It looks legit. <laughs> so fight happening here. Blub blub. Where have you been, sweetheart? Blub blub. <laughs> Hi, baby. Where have you been? Man, I don't need Yoda. I have a big old Yoda over there and a baby Yoda. So let me go over there and let's do the Mandalorian silhouette. And on such a small scale, this is my finger. It's very small. <laughs> I think it looks amazing, though. I love this. That came out so good. Look how cool that looks. I don't want to throw a BB-8 because Star Wars has several different generations that it's hit, and BB-8 is one of those. So I might do 
Maybe I do C3PO and R2D2 over here and Chewie somewhere. In the middle somewhere, we'll do a BB-8. Yes, let me work on that right now. Players are here. This is, <laughs> my phone's still cracked, but whatever. <laughs> R2D2, C3PO, Chewie, ATATs, Princess Leia, Han Solo, Luke and Darth Vader, Kylo Ren, BB-8 and Rey, and the Mandalorian. I didn't put any of the Yodas because they're already here, but this seals the deal, man. For this one, I'm almost done with my mural. I'm so excited. My favorite's gotta be the Death Star. There's so much detail in here. I tried new things, I've learned new things. The gradation of the background was so much fun watching it come together. The shadows and highlights, which I might need to add a little bit more there, but we'll see. I just, I'm so proud of it. It looks so cool. All right, I'm gonna cap it here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll see you next time.